for my life mitts. Thank you so much for stopping by. I wanted to do this month's unboxing of the mustache stationery. I, I know that last month was, uh, I think it was just, you know, music over the unboxing and some of you have voiced that you would prefer to have me talk through it. So here I am uh, unboxing this month's box. Last month it took quite a while to get here. I went to Uganda as you know. Um, but here it is. So so let's begin with the unboxing. So here it is. This month's theme is uh, new notes and doodles. Wow, so that's interesting. Hopefully you can see that there. And these are the companies I believe that are included in this month's kit. So let's see, the first thing here is a, oh, it's post-it notes, very cool design, some yellow ones and this like, I think this is gray, gray grid, red and gray grid. And the company name is pansydaisy.com, made in Korea. That's really nice. One is a ballpoint pen 0 0.5 color on you, and the company is Live Work. Oh, this is nice. Oh, I really love colorful pens. Let's see what ink it is. I'm just gonna open this up. I'm just gonna take my whole bunch of titch because I have so many blank pages. I will just. Um, did one here. So this is the Live Work Vermil Vermilion. Oops. Nice and smooth, and I love this fine tip. I don't know about you, but sometimes I just want to write in ballpoint pen. Just sometimes, um, maybe. I just want to write something and I don't want it to smudge or I just want to write a whole lot. Sometimes I reach for my ball I reach for ballpoint pens. I don't know if you have the same thing, but but I'm loving this color combination. So nice and bright. I love those kinds of things. Alright, the next one here is oh markers. This is the iconic design color twin pen. Everything is going to be alright. And I think, yeah, this looks like it's from Korea. And the brand is Icon. I'm just going to grab one set just to show you what it looks like. This one has a green and a brown. Oh, this is not a marker. I assumed it was a marker, but it looks like it is a pen. So it took a while for the ink to start flowing and of course that's not a major issue at all. It's brand new. So let's try the bl uh, brown side. So same with this one, you just need a bit of... Get to get the ink flowing, so... I think this would be really nice to use if you are a person that likes to use color coding for planning. Um, and also you can use this, some people use like markers for the Hobonichi Techo when you're doodling and you have these different colors. I think it would be really, really useful. So there's brown, green, and I think this is a gray. I'm going to take it out and try it out. So there's the red and blue. Get the ink flowing. Red. This one is the blue one. Oh, this is really nice. I like the blue color. This one is orange. These don't have specific colors, do they? I don't think so. This one is orange. And this one I think is gray, but let's see. Could be black. Oh, this one's not really coming out. There we go. It does look like gray. It's definitely not a black. It's not really dark, uh, like a black is. But I think it's more of like a charcoal, it could be. But anyway, it's really, really nice. 
So there's those pens. And made in the USA, the word notebooks. I don't think I have any word notebooks. See what it looks like inside. A cool material project, wordnotebooks.com, made in the USA. So, ooh, I love these. I love the cover of these uh, notebooks. This one is 48 pages lined. Oh, and they all have these like bullets. So, I guess they're really useful for um, to do lists and things. And then you can write your name, notes, the day, and user guide. I guess this is for bullet journaling. Uh, there's like a legend here. Bullet point, important, in progress, and complete. I might have to look into bullet journaling. I've always wanted to try, um, but... And then it says here, take better notes. I, you can see... Uh, Skip vowels unless necessary and just like nice little tips. That's really, really neat. And the paper quality seems really nice, but I will definitely give this a try. These are three world, uh, not world, <laughs> word notebooks. Really nice. And then here is, this is what I saw on John Rush's uh, thumbnail. I saw this image and I didn't I wanted to open it to see what was in this month's unboxing but it was so I was so tempted to do to open it up and I think this is a card let's take a look here card of camera yeah it's, it's a blank card with an envelope that you can use for writing so that was this month's kit. If you have any questions, as always, please feel free to comment below. I hope you enjoyed watching. I will see you soon. Bye!